We have all heard of the term Internet of Things or IoT. As it is becoming an increasingly growing topic of conversation, let's try and understand what exactly is Internet of Things. You may be watching this video on your PC or phone and it is connected to the Internet. Internet on your device could be connected through broadband or Wi-Fi. Simply put, this is the concept of basically connecting any device with an on-off switch to the internet. There is people-to-people -people connection, there is people-to-machine connection, and then we have machine-to-machine -machine connection. Internet of Things or IoT refers to billions of physical devices around the world that are now connected to the internet, collecting and sharing data. As the price of processors and wireless networks go down, technology is becoming cheap and penetration of smartphones are skyrocketing. It has become possible to turn anything into a part of the Internet of Things. It is like adding a level of digital intelligence to the devices that would allow them to communicate with a human being or with another machine. And that's not all. According to reports, there would be more than 26 billion connected devices by 2020. That's a lot of connections, isn't it? But why on earth do we need so many connected devices? Let's take another example. Mike has to go for a morning meeting. His alarm clock wakes him up at 7 a.m. and notifies the coffee maker to start brewing coffee. When he goes to take a shower, the geezer was already notified and warm water was available for Mike saving his time. Mike's car is connected to his calendar and tells him to take the best route to avoid traffic. If the traffic is heavy, his car might send a text to another party notifying them that Mike will be late. The Internet of Things can be applied to transportation, production, smart cities and many other projects saving us energy, time and reducing waste. We are yet to completely understand how Internet of Things will impact our lives. What would be the opportunities and challenges that will come with it? For now, the best thing that we can do is to educate ourselves about Internet of Things because IoT Storm is here to stay and the new rule of the future is going to be anything that can be connected will be connected.